Welcome to tutorial 1 and welcome to Adobe Premiere Rush CC. We find ourselves a new welcome screen, which invites us to create a new project. So select create a new project. A new project is based on selecting the assets that we need. I've already downloaded the files from the Adobe Education Exchange link in the course content. While selecting all the videos I'm already creating a rough edit. I'm also selecting the JPEG and the audio to finish up the story. Please do not forget to give your project a name. Adobe Premiere Rush is available on mobile, tablet and desktop computer. So by enabling the Sync with Creative Cloud option, you are able to continue your project on other devices. When all looks great, hit Create. This is the editing interface of Adobe Premiere Rush CC. The audio file gives us the idea of the length of the final edit. We've got way too much video content right now. With the scroll bar down below we can zoom in to the timeline. Just click and drag the right end of the scroll bar to the left to zoom in. This will give us a closer look to the first clip. I want to shorten the first clip a little bit. Select the clip and drag the right orange handle to the left, just a tiny bit. All clips on the right side will jump to the left as well on this magnetic timeline. On the second clip we will cut a bit from the beginning and the ending of this clip, with the same technique of dragging the orange handles. The third clip is way too long. Let's cut it short with use of the scissors. This will split the clip, so you can delete the part that you don't need with the bin button. Let's continue this process with the other clips and aim to tell the story within 30 seconds. There are several different workspaces in Adobe Premiere Rush CC to work in. The thing that bothers me right now is the sound underneath some clips. I only want to hear the music. Select a clip with sound underneath and go to the audio workspace. In here you can mute the audio. I'll do that for the other clip too. You've now created your rough edit. And this is the end of tutorial number one. In the next one we will add titles, work with color and do some speed changes. And of course export out our final video. Hi everyone, thanks for watching. Click the link in the description below to explore more free online professional development on the Adobe Education Exchange. And click the link on screen to subscribe to the channel for more videos.